this is Desmond here with Pride Auto Detailing. Hope you're doing well today. In this video, I am going to try something that I've never tried before, and that's going to be polishing on this vinyl. Now, as you can see, the vinyl has a lot of scratches on it. Um, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be polishing it and uh, seeing if we're able to get the scratches out. Um, the first thing we want to do is we want to clean it. So what I've done is I've gotten some of my very old bucket of O&R that I used for my cars that I did today. I'm uh, not going to be too careful with it, you know, I'm sure that it'll clean fine enough. That O&R bucket cleaned two cars today, so hopefully it will clean this well enough and I'm just trying to get off all the dirt. The owner of this car maintains it pretty well, so it doesn't need a clay, it feels like, so I'm not going to bother claying this particular hood, but we'll see how it goes. So, dry the hood here, dry the hood real quick, and we're going to see how she polishes. And I just love O&R. I mean, it is the best chemical for cleaning your car quickly. As you can see, I'm putting very little effort. I'm getting all that dust and dirt that was on this hood off. And it's smooth and nice. And it honestly adds a little bit of a shine, too. But, all right, so let's take a look and see how that hood looks now. Get my swirl light on it. And you can still see the O&R there. It hasn't completely dried. I'm not going to be too crazy about drying it all perfectly. But you can see there's lots and lots of swirls and it's pretty beat up. All right, so I'm going to grab my, grab my Garros 3 inch polisher. And I'm not going to be, or this is a 6 inch polisher, grab my 6 inch polisher. And I'm not going to be too crazy with it. I'm just going to use this old pad that I used from polishing the car earlier today and see how it performs. And that's the greatest thing about detailing is it's like you get to experiment and have fun with it and just kind of see how it goes down. So just to make this a little bit scientific, I am going to go ahead and put some tape down here right down the middle. So we can see how she does. I haven't quite decided what polish I'm going to use yet. I think I'm going to try something light. Something light. So I'm looking for my polish. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, there she is. Oh. So this, this time I'm going to be using HD polish. Um, like I said, I've never done this before and I don't know what particular combination of polishes or compounds or pads are going to work, but I'm going to try it with this polish and see if I can make it better. So this is an experiment in detailing. And when you're loading up the pad, you want to make sure that you just do, you know, four little drops on there. It's fine. And, and this is kind of the moment of truth here. I'm going to work in a two by two square area and start on speed one to kind of start on speed one to kind of work it up and then I'm going to kick it into speed three and just see how it does. Now this is a relatively new pad, which is great. I can already feel that it's cutting pretty good. You can almost feel it. I think this is going to work, but don't quote me yet. So I'm just going to keep working this little 2x2 two two area and see what level of cut I can get with just the polish and an orange pad. As you can see, I'm not going too fast. I'm taking my time because there's a lot of scratches there. And what we're doing is we're leveling the paint down, or in this case, the vinyl. 
So I'm going to take my time and let it cut. All right. So, uh, like I said, I've never done that before. I don't know how it's going to come. Uh, working the machine in my hand, it felt pretty good. But we'll see. Already I can tell it's much, much shinier than the other area here if you can catch that in the camera and that is just with polish let's take a look and see how it does under the light here so as you can see we have this area with tons and tons of scratches and swirls and I come down and I have some defect removal probably about 40 to 50 percent but you can definitely see a much more shiny glossy surface the oxidation is not all over it and yeah I'll kind of remove this tape and yeah so if a person spent the time and polished their vinyl to try to rejuvenate it get more life out of it if you ask Desmond from Pride Auto Detailing he would tell you that that's a good idea so I want to thank you very much for watching, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and like us on social media. Have a great day. Bye-bye.